Hello, everybody. <laughs> that was ugly. I was ready. I had everything loaded. I'm, I'm, I, hold on. Okay. I, I, I don't know what that was about. That, that, that was scary. Um, Thank you all for hanging out and waiting. Oh, I'm muted. Okay, I'm unmuted. Girl, uh, see, full moon. It's a full moon. Things happen. Things are bad. Welcome, everybody. It's FO Friday, and I am BJ from BJ's Crochet. I apologize from, for being, well, I wasn't late. I was here, but all I had was this little circle going around and around, and it's like, ooh, 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 ooh. So thank you all for hanging out. Michael's here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Dawn is here. Hi, sweetie. Zoella, your prize ship today. Keep your eyes out for it. That's exciting. Zoella, so happy to see you. How are you, your mom and Esteban? Cammy says, we were blessed to be serenaded with music from our new music director slash organist today. That's impressive. I like a good organ. Well, I used to like the organ. We haven't had anybody play the organ in so long. I don't know if I like organ music anymore or not. Uh, Roberta's here. Girl, look, weird weather here today. Wind shaking the rafters. That was last week. Sun is shining and mixed snow and rain. Roberta. You've got snow. Girl, look, it's 75 degrees out here. I got the doors open. The windows are open. I may never breathe again. I started to do the live from the deck and I was like, eh, no, traffic noise is, is too loud out here. But when we leave here, I've already made my dinner. I'm going to take the computer and my dinner outside. I may never breathe again, but I'm going outside. Hope you like it, Mr. Yondall, and I picked it out. It's special. You're blessed and loved. That's sweet. Roberta says, I think Mother Nature must be spring cleaning and throwing all her unused storms into my yard. <laughs> Are you still marinating? Well, see, you were complaining about marinating in the pollen. So she's she's cleaning you off with the snow and the rain now. You're getting a bath and you just don't appreciate her efforts. She's washing off the marinade. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mom needs her medication. Just drive carefully, Zoella. Don, that's so sweet. I got to make sure I thank him too. Oh, that's sweet of both of you. And Cammy is loving his uh, mute. And Cammy, don't scare her off asking her all those questions. Mother, yeah, Mother Nature has a weird sense of humor. She really does. She really does. Dinky Jen, hello, hello. How are you? Thank you for coming by. I hope to have a fab weekend, and I hope you do as well. And there is Sarah. Hello, hello. You'll be lurking and working on your poncho. Do you have a deadline for your poncho? You're not going to try to have it ready for Sunday, are you? And Roberta says, I keep trying to learn to lurk, but I fail every time. I know. It, it's, it's a skill I have not acquired. I, some days I do better than others. Paula, hello, hello. So good to see you. Thank you for being here. How are you? Roberta says, I used to be able to do 20 impossible things before breakfast and the carry on with the day. Now impossible is just out of girl, look. That's what I told my doctor the other day. I said, I used to be able to multitask. Now I can't even add in my head. Fix it. Fix. I'm. I'm sitting there going. I. I. I can't. 
I can't I can't even add in my head anymore. This is this is I, I don't like this. Cami says, Zala, I was grown yesterday. I read Mark 15 verses 16 to 20 for the Tenebrae service. There you go, Cami. Michael says, well, I won't be able to make the live, so wanted to leave some love. Oh, thank you, Michael. I appreciate it. And if I don't see you, you have a blessed and happy weekend. Yes, indeed. Uh, everybody speaking. Roberta's asking if it's date night. Suze, hello, hello. So good to see you. Thank you for being here. How are you? What's in your cup? And everybody, it is F.O. Friday. Choo, hello, hello. So good to see you. Thank you for being here. Hugs and blessings, Shatika. I am so happy to see you. And there's our little tanky poo. Hello. Thank you, everyone who has come in today. Yeah, I, I couldn't get stuff to work again. Well, no, Chris, it, it wasn't that. It was, I had this, this black screen. It wasn't working. It wasn't working. It just, just, it just, it just, I, I, I just, I hit the magic wheel and just reset because I, I don't know. I don't know. Nifty, how are you? Oh, has it really, Pam? Oh, well, good. I'm glad to hear because I was like, I had it all set up. I had it ready. And everybody, we're going to try something new today. Uh, thanks to my dear darling, Sunita. Sunita. She walked me through how to redirect. Kelly already has her live set up. Please check your um, screen and make sure that you have autoplay on. And when Kelly goes live, we will redirect and automatically go over to Kelly's. You don't have to do anything but sit back, put your feet up, have your popcorn ready. And you don't even have to have your permission slip signed. You just have to have auto autoplay on if I did this correctly. We will see. Maybe I'll be Sunita's star pupil. <laughs> and Roberta says, everyone, please remember to hit the thumbs before you leave today. Thank you. Love that I get to say it today. I appreciate that. And Zoila is saying hi to everyone. Uh, Tank is saying hi to everyone, but she is not yelling. She is having a uh, visual problems and she has to put the caps caps locks on and able to see what she's doing so nobody take any offense we're doing happiness today um there there's my my teacher crick hey all oh, got frozen chicken in the air fryer did you make your spaghetti? Did you ever get spaghetti or did you give up on the spaghetti? Cricket, welcome in. So good to see you. How are you? Thank you for being here. Yep, I was here. Am I? I'm not. Look, I was hitting all kinds of buttons. That's all I can say. All the buttons all over the place trying to get things to work in my favor. Nifty says... Uh, she's saying hi. So nice to see all of you. And she's sending hugs and kisses. Sunita has no F.O. Girl, that's okay. We don't always have F.O.s. We do this for fun. Uh, Chris is saying hi. My mom on her way. So we'll catch some and then catch replay. Chris, I didn't know you still had your mother. That's awesome. Please you love on your mom while you have her and we'll be here. Yes, Zoila, you are the only, well, Zoila, are you still on mute? Yeah, I was having issues. Let's see, I was just I I 
<laughs> I, I I have no words. I just have no words. Okay. I I I I tried. Uh Pam says, don't forget I emailed you two FOs. <sighs> Thank you, because I did. Thank you. Pam, girl, yes. Please don't ever remind me. Don't ever hesitate to remind me to check my email because oh, mama tries. I, I try. It, it doesn't always work out in my favor, but I try. You have to give me an A for effort. Uh, oh, snap. Hold on, Pam. Now I gotta find it. Okay, hold on. Um, I'm sorry. Uh, the it, the kids are out of school today, and I got all kinds of stuff going <laughs> going on outside my window, and I'm just try, trying to be aware when it's time to duck. Mm, okay, gotcha. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. You and Dawn. Okay. All right. Thank you. And Roberta says, I tried to finish my kitty, but the darn thing didn't want to cooperate. You, you can't force the process. You, you just got to go with it. You just got to go. I'm going to restart the device because I still cannot hear anything. Be right back. Hopefully we'll be here unless something else happens. Darcia, welcome in. So good to see you. Thank you for coming by. And Miss Gloria is here. Hello, hello. And Suze is saying hi. Zoila, uh, Pam is telling Zoila I had to do it too. Restart as I had no sound or mic. Yeah, I had to restart mine as well. It's like, what is going on here? Woohoo! Yay! Okay, Zoila, you're in there. Sunita, don't give me an, an A double plus yet because we don't know if I did. I I think I got it. I think I think I can. I think I can. <laughs> Jazz, hi sis, blessings. It is so good to see you here. How are you? Okay, so Sunita, she. You did spaghetti in the Instapot? Isn't the Instapot like a pressure cooker? You pressure cooked your spaghetti? Okay. Oh. It takes all about happy. Okay. DJ, if I start hitting buttons, I my phone. girl, look, I'm sitting here hitting all the buttons. It's like, you need to work. You were working. I hit live, and then all of a sudden, you decide you're not going to work. I'm not, I'm not having it. I'm not having it. Cricket says, hope everyone has a beautiful weekend, a blessed Easter, and know you are loved. Cricket, that is awesome sentiment. Thank you. Sandra S.C. I've spent the day on the phone with Geek Squad about Windows 11 and this laptop. They fixed the problem I'm having. Hey, that's awesome. I'm glad they fixed the problem, but it took all day. Oh, my goodness. But they fixed it. That's important. Roberta says, Tank. And she's laughing. I just figured that some people talk loud. It's what's said, not how loud, low or how loud. Well, Roberta, it depends upon the person because some people think they're being yelled at and then they get all freaked out because they're being yelled at. So as long as everybody knows the tank's not yelling and we're all good because, you know, this is a happy zone and I don't tolerate any drama. This, this is not the place because we, we are all one big happy family and we're going to be family. And if mama has to put people over in the corner, I don't, I don't mind giving people time out until you, you know, sometimes you have to have an attitude adjustment. I have given myself times out because I've had to have an attitude adjustment. <laughs> oh, oh, 
man. <laughs> yeah, sometimes I just need to, to get myself under control because I'm just... This, uh, Roberta is saying to Sandra, my laptop did that, updated and frustrated the heck out of me. Remember when my laptop uh, updated and I lost my camera? It, it it couldn't even find my camera. I had to go through, I think, three different tutorials to figure out how to get my camera back. Oh, tank count at 17 finished objects. So it is a good thing that we have two hours today because Granny D is not going live. Uh, I think Tank has been over. Uh, yeah, she's been over in the group counting because usually when I start out, I'll have like six in the group and I'll start chatting. And then when I start doing finished objects, like she says, I got 17. And then that's why we had... That's why we had two whips on Wednesday because I, I couldn't rush through it. I had to stay. Hey there, VJ. The LASIK eye surgery was successful. No more eyeglasses and 2015 vision. Better than 2020. God bless me. That is awesome. Congratulations. I am so happy for you. I am so happy for you. I don't mind wearing glasses. I'm scared of letting people mess with my eyes. <laughs> I'm, I'm just scared. I'm just scared. Sandra is saying, Roberta, I got this laptop yesterday. What? And was having pop-ups that wouldn't quit. Plus many other issues. Crossing my fingers, but it appears to be working okay now. I'm knocking on wood for you. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. I did finish three, but can only show one. That's fine. Debbie, welcome in. Good to see you. Thank you for coming by. How are you? Oh, so yeah, Zola, I saw your son bunny in her pretty little dress. Yeah, we're all glad you got it fixed, Sandra. Cindy, how are you? Here listening, lurking a bit. That's okay. Mimi, you made it. Thank you for being here. Yeah, her dress is cute. Yeah, your little son, some bunny is not walking around naked. I sent myself home and ground myself when I have attitudes, girl. Yeah, there's sometimes I just have to go stand in the corner and, you know, they say, breathe in, breathe out, because, ooh, those people at work used to just work my last nerve, and I had to get myself together. I'm okay with sitting in the corner with night buttons, <laughs> because I would open my mouth, and it's like, you can't say that. And, you know, people are expecting me to answer their nonsensical demands and it's kind of like i'm just gonna stand here for a minute and get myself together because whatever i say i'm gonna get written up for because they're being stupid they do that so you can see near and for 2015. oh okay Mimi is saying to Zoila, congratulations on some bunny. I'm making my second wonky some bunny. You know what? If they were perfect, they wouldn't be unique. Hello, hello. Good Friday. I don't know if we should say happy Good Friday because I said that earlier and then I was kind of like, that's, that's, it's not really supposed to be a happy occasion, but I know what you mean, Marsha Lee. Welcome in. Good to see you. Thank you for being here. And she's sending love and hugs. Tag says, my glasses will be 2015, but my right eye lens probably will be farsighted only. You know, it's it is it's better than the alternative. Mimi says I have to count to a minimum of twenty. Uh, I used to have to do that in Spanish because it took me longer. Mm -hmm. 
I, I, I had, I would count to 20 in Spanish. And then if they were really bothering me, I would do it in French because I, I at the time I could only get up to 10 in French and, and then I'd really have to stand there and concentrate because it's like, you all are just... And then I had a trauma surgeon who um, her goal was to learn to count to 10 in, or I, maybe not 10, I forgot what, what her number goal was, but her goal was to learn to count in every language. So periodically she'd come in and one of the texts would say, what language are we doing today? And she'd say what the language is and she'd start counting. And I'd sit there and go, I, I, I could not remember that. I just couldn't. Lauren, welcome in. Good to see you. Thank you for coming by. How are you? Are you feeling better? How is little miss? Oh, Shirley, I'm so sorry, but I'm glad you found me. Thank you so much for being here. I scheduled it early. I don't know why you didn't get a notification. And there is Nancy. Hello, hello. Party can start now. All right. Thank you, Chandler. I appreciate this. I don't know. Yeah, uh, Tank is saying check. Make sure your bell is the black bell because the uh, um, halo, the silhouette bell, you don't always get notif notified with. I appreciate it, Chandler. Thank you so very much. How are you today? Okay, yeah, let's get this party started because Nancy is here. Dawn is here. Everybody's here. Yeah, and we've got we've got things to do. Yes, one eye was fixed for distance and the other for reading. The brain makes the adjustments. It was slightly blurry reading for two days, but I could still read. Now everything is good. Oh. I wonder if my brain knows it's supposed to make those types of adjustments. I'm glad it works. Melanie, I must make an appointment with my eye doctor. Thanks. Yeah, I've got to do my eye doctor and I need to have my teeth cleaned. Little Miss is good. I have another hospital stay this week. Oh, Lauren, I am so sorry, but she's better now. I am glad you are on the road to recovery. I really am. I am so sorry. Girl, you are really catching it here lately, but you know what? God's in control. You're going to be all right. Okay, Shirley says, yes, Black Bell, weird. I kept checking back but I'm here now. You know what, Shirley? Um, take the bell off and then put it back on. Sometimes you, you, you have to get out of it and get back in. Chandler is saying to Sandra, I'm not sure I've been busy with some things. I hope soon though. Okay. How's the coaching going, Chandler? Mimi says, if my brain knew, it's forgotten. See, I, I don't know that my brain even knew it was supposed to do things like that. Because I know I've got the uh, graduated lenses and I look up at the um, highway signs. I can't read them. I, I can't read them. I don't, I don't, I, I don't, I do not know. Okay, here we go. That, that's enough of me babbling. Um, Pam has finished this luscious scarf. I like the way you've done this in Two Shades of Coral. That is so pretty, Pam. I really like that effect. Ooh, that's pretty. That is pretty. So I'm happy you can hang out with us too. God bless you, Angelese. I appreciate you being here. Thank you. I feel like it's it'll happen again before this issue is resolved. Oh, Lauren, girl, I am so sorry. Shh. 
Roberta saying to Shirley, sometimes I don't get any notifications. YT is funny that way. Yeah, and there are some times when I know my friends are live and I can't even find the live. We're so, yes, you had to take mom. To, oh, she said, her, Zarla, did you have to take your mom to the ER or is this just a medication refill? And Nancy is asking Zoila if everything is okay. Mimi is saying, Zoila, I put out an all points bulletin for you. Oh dear. Oh dear, dear, dear. Zoila says, I do not enjoy driving at night. The glare from the headlights is too much for me. Right, I, I agree. I really agree. I know, isn't that a pretty color? Pam, I really like the way you did that. You are so welcome. Oh, mom was back in the hospital. Oh, Zoila, I'm sorry. Is she home now? Yeah, night driving is un yeah, night driving is unpleasant. And then they're doing so much um construction work around here. I can leave and know how I'm getting back home. But by the time I'm coming home, the roads are closed. They've got these little cone things in the road. And it's like, how am I supposed to get out? How am I supposed to get home? What am I supposed to be doing here? I don't understand. I don't understand. And then Dawn, ooh, Dawn finished her hat and scarf set. Dawn, this is really pretty. Let me let's see i need a smaller comment i don't have a smaller comment okay i have to go back to nancy okay oh lord okay that's pretty Dawn, that is really, really, really pretty. Where is Madonna? She needs to see that green. Shirley says, my son-in-law's uncle went to QT and bought us all slushies. Mango in the cup again. Ooh. She was released today. Oh my goodness. How is Esteban? My left eye has an astigmatism, so nighttime. Especially if it's raining, I don't drive. Yeah, I it's, it's yeah. Nancy says, Zola, I hope she's doing better as well as can be expected. Yes. No, I didn't know either. I prefer night driving. There's less traffic and less chance of road rage. Uh, well, six in one hand, half a dozen in the other. There, I might be uh, in the middle of road rage, but I wouldn't know it because I can't see them. <laughs> might be involved in all kinds of things and I don't know it. So Ella says, mom was having trouble breathing and finally released. I'm a happy camper again. I know you are. Lauren says, late night driving is okay, but not when it's dark and rush hour or busy. Well, if it's late night, it's dark then, isn't it? I know Mimi is cute. Can Kathleen, hello, hello. I finished my royal blue fedora hat with navy blue striped and trimmed in navy blue. I have raspberry iced tea in my cup. That is awesome. Uh, Tank is asking Zoila if they put her on oxygen. Nancy says, Zoila, that's scary and tiring for you both. Hospitals are no place to get good. 
good rest, bad rest, or any kind of rest. Because every time you, they wake you up, beautiful dawn. That is from um, Dozer Dawn. And the hat appears to be a central hat. I'm not sure what pattern she used for the scarf. I know the mixed colors are beautiful. Welcome back, Dorcia. It is pretty. That Mimi is from Dozer Dawn. It is beautiful. That's from Dozer. And she is, I know, I night driving is not my favorite thing. People all the time I drive are still too groggy to get road rage. Let me see if she, t you know, you know me, I open the pictures. I don't read the words. Let me see if she told me. Yes, she did. Silly me. Barocco Ultra Alpaca in colorway peach mix. And the pattern is the boyfriend scarf, needle size seven. That does not tell me about the hat. Okay, when Dozer comes into the chat, we have to clarify the hat. Okay. Um... Oh, Zarla, thank you. Zarla also sent me a picture of her sun bunny. See, I have to come back to Dawn. Well, we have to see her little tootsies. That is so cute, Zarla. Look at you. And you were struggling with it. You finished her. She is so cute. Like one of my friends used to say, look what I can do. Ah, uh, Dawns, yeah. We got a lot of Dawns in the family, don't we? Yep, it was Dozer Dawn. The dark bothers me less than the glaring headlights of the other cars. Right? Say it again, Lauren. Say it again. Marsha Lee says, I was finally able to walk four driveways away from my house during mobility lessons, then turn my way back and find my house. Woohoo! But my mo mobility teacher was there with me. That's okay, Marsha Lee. You were able to do it. That is awesome. That is awesome. Oh, my gracious. She was pretending like she wasn't there and I had to walk back by myself. Ooh, Marsha Lee, doesn't that make, girl, stand up and take a bow. That is fantastic. Oh, Sunita says, just chugged a bottle of water and a little hug time for, just chugged a bottle of water and a little hug. Now time for coffee. Okay. Welcome in, Bridget. Good to see you. Thank you for being here. How are you and the king? Lauren says, I was like, you woke me up to ask about dinner. Dinner was trivial to my brain at that point. I wanted sleep. Yeah, I know. I, I had just gotten to the point where I went to sleep anytime I could go to sleep because they were waking me up every four hours. It didn't matter. Every four hours... And if I had a fever, it was every two hours. So it was like, I just slept when I could because I wasn't getting enough sleep. Mimi is saying to Marsha Lee, I still only walk in home or in stores. Roadways are still a no for me. After I fell 12, 14, 2023, 20, my steps are up to 3,900. Oh, Mimi, well, it, you're making progress. That is great. That is great. 
Zoila, you did great. You really did. Lauren says, then you get a knock every hour for OBS, meds, drinks, cleaning, changeover. Girl, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then they want to know why you're cranky. Yeah, think. I had I I thought they were lying to me, but I, I had a nurse wake me up. She did my vitals, had me get up and go to the restroom, and then asked me if I wanted a sleeping pill. I said, no, I want you to go away and leave me alone. I sleep just fine. Thank you. She wakes me up and asks me if I want a sleeping pill. No, I want you to go away. Thank you. Please and thank you. Yeah, you, you can't rest in the hospital. Just finished watching your winnings opening video. Oh, the dress was harder than the sun bunny. Oh, Soila, you did great, though. You did great. You did great. And everybody remind me, if Dozer comes in, they want to know the um, what yarn her hat was in. My internet must have issues. You keep stopping on me. Refresh. I had to because I couldn't even get started, much less stopping. Bridget says, doing the best we can. I'm keeping busy getting my sewing stuff into the sewing room and the craft room back into shape. Did you switch rooms? Shirley said, are the opposite and don't come in when you need them. Yeah, there is that too. The yeah, mm -hmm. hospitals wake you up and tell you it's bedtime. <laughs> I had a nurse come in at seven o'clock and wake me up and introduce herself to me and tell me that she was going to be my nurse for the shift. I look at the clock, it's seven o'clock. I look out the window, the sun is out and everything. So I, you know, pull myself up in the bed, get my bed all situated, clean off my table because I'm waiting for my medication so I can have breakfast. <laughs> and after about 45 minutes, I call them and ask them if they're gonna bring my medication so I can have breakfast. And they're like, breakfast was 12 hours ago. I said, but it's seven o'clock. They said, but it's seven o'clock in the evening. And I said, oh, I said, well, I'm sorry. The lady woke me up and told me what her name was. And I thought it was morning time. She says, that's what she gets for waking you up. I had been there through the time change. So I was used to seven o'clock at night. It was dark. That was the first day, seven o'clock at night had still had daylight. And I'm thinking it's time for breakfast. I hadn't even had dinner. They had me so twisted. I didn't know what I was doing. And then they'd come and do a cognitive check. And Nifty says, VJ, she woke you up to see if you needed a sleeping pill. Good heaven. No, she woke me up to check my, my I had had surgery, check my stitches and everything and have me go and rinse my stitches and put on a fresh dressing and all that. And then after I had climbed out of the bed, she's like, oh, do you want a sleeping pill? It's like, no, I just want you to leave me. I'm I'm sleeping and they're making me get up to go tend to my stitches. It's like, I'm like, I'm sleeping. Leave me alone. Oh, do you want a sleeping pill? No, I want you to just go away and leave me alone. Because I was fine. I was fine. I was fine. I was like, yep, I'm not responding to painkillers and my insides are falling out. Wonder why I'm grumpy. Yeah. Yeah. And the insurance companies only, you know, let you get certain medications for certain diagnoses. And you're kind of like, this is not working. Can we do something else? Oh, well, uh, this is our standard practice. Yeah, but I'm not your standard patient. It ain't working. Plan B. What, what's, what's plan B? Big time checked off the list. <laughs> ah, they didn't have a room for mom. We stayed in the e -har. Oh my gosh. I hate it when they do that. 
And and you know what's really sad about that? They're going to charge you for four days of ER. Even though you sh you were supposed to be in a room. They're not going to charge you room charge. They're going to charge you ER charge. That, I think, is not fair. Crystal, welcome in. So good to see you. Thank you for coming by. How are you? Just expanded. Took over the formal dining room for my sewing. Bridget. <laughs> oh, Bridget. No, you didn't. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no, that's bad. I've been so blessed. I even received private room with, did you? Yeah. Yeah, because when when, when, when you have that, they, they were giving everybody a private room. They started out co-hosting and then they decided that wasn't a good idea. I had them all scheduled one behind the other because I had to shut my room down for an hour. I did them one behind the hour and one behind the, the other and then shut my room down for an hour. And they're like, oh, no, you got to shut down in between patients. And I'm like, oh, no, because I can't get anything done if you make me shut down my room for an hour after every patient. Not going to happen. Yeah, sometimes they just don't think. It's like, what do you, what do you think I'm going to do these patients? I'm sure mom was really mixed up, girl. Yeah, it's they. We have never been to that hospital, and I told mom we will not be going there ever again. I totally understand. Welcome in, Miguel. How are you? Hello, hello, hello. How's everything in your life? Let me see where that finish. We showed Don Aaron's lamp. We showed Denny's which way filet, right? I did this. Hold on. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying to catch up to where I left off. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right. So now we're going over here. Don't mind me. They got me twisted. Okay. Uh, ooh, we have the, I think this is Nancy. The Granny Ripple Crescent Shawl by Fiber Spider. How do you wear this? This is one of those you have to fold in half, correct? Fold it in half and wear it. I made a circular shawl for um, Shorty, and I wasn't I wasn't loving the way it needed to be worn. I lost my there we go hello. I'm lost in the tabs, y'all. That's a shawl? That's interesting. I made a, a, a baby tote blanket out of a um, star. That's interesting. That's pretty. Uh, gonna wash dishes and be listening. Well, thank you, Miguel. I appreciate it. Hi, Jerry. Welcome in. Good to see you. How are you? Crystal says, I don't do well with hospital stays because I get anxious and get yelled at by nurses for being outside smoking instead of sleeping. I know I need to quit. Girl, I, I yeah. Yeah. Our campus is now non-smoking. You have to go down. You have to go down on the corner. Lauren says, I think it is a bit of different for NHS, but honestly, the painkillers were moderate and I was in severe pain. I have moderate painkillers at home. I hear you. Yeah, I know your NHS is different. It's almost an hour, girl. See, you know what happens when we get to talking. Uh, Zoila definitely marked that one off, but here in Texas, 
there is a high number of RSV and C19. I wear a mask even in home. See, Mimi, my problem is, is I wear a mask every place I go, but when I pick up Shorty and she gets in my car, I forget that she's been out in the public and I don't put a mask on. I have to remember to, to wear a mask around her because she no longer wants to wear a mask. Nobody wears mask anymore, Granny. Why do I have to wear a mask? I said, well, you don't have to wear a mask. You just can't come over to my house. <laughs> Lauren, seriously? Ooh, it's because women can tolerate more pain than men. That's why women have the babies, right? Still finishing up at the house. Have a meeting before the drive. Please be careful, Jerry. They kept me in the trauma room and charged me triple. Oh, tang, tang, tang. Yeah, that was a pun. <laughs> Sorry. You know, sometimes I'm too literal. You know that, right? One room is too small for five sewing machines, three spinning wheels, a place to sit and tables for cutting, not to mention the fabric and yarn. I had to have more space. I understand. Bridget, do you have a basement in your home? You need to make yourself a little factory. Mom was so confused, but I guess they wanted to monitor her before sending her home. Her home, BJ. I didn't thinking about the ER prices, girl. Uh huh. They're gonna charge you for the ER. Mm -hmm. Even though it's not your fault, you spent four days in the ER. They're gonna charge you ER prices. I hope you got good insurance, cause that that really, really, really sucks. And I've always thought that was unfair. Even when I was in the industry, I thought it was unfair. <laughs> Mimi says, Bridget, why do you need three spinning wheels? Because they're all a little bit different. Oh, why am I scrolling? And I'm not saying what's going on here. Hold on. We have our members are scrolling through. Please check out my members. Mimi says, five sewing machines, you need to consolidate. I bet they all do something different. My grandmother had three. Nancy says, Zoila, when mom was in the hospital in December, as they were wheeling her from a room to ER, long story, I got an alert on my phone for an ER charge. Doesn't that just make you want to hit somebody in the head? Mm -hmm. They came in at two o'clock and, and told me they were discharging me. I said, mm -mm. I said, I have already paid for the day. I am, sp I am spending the night. I've already paid for it. I'll go home tomorrow. And they just looked at me. I said, uh, 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 discharge is 10 o'clock. It's after 10 o'clock. You've already billed me for today. I'm not leaving. <laughs> One is for taking with me when I go out. One is for thinner yarns. One is for applying larger balls of yarn or making yarn art. Told you they all did something different. And you have a motorized one? Bad picture, VJ. Wonky place. I could only place I could put it was on the table. That's okay. That's a good. Have you seen my pictures? You did a good job. It was like pulling teeth when they eventually decided to prescribe, to prescribe me or a morph on discharge. I haven't even used it yet. Yet they give it out willy nilly for a broken toe. Bridget says, okay, one embroidery machine, one quilting machine, one sewing machine, one antique treadle machine, and one serger. So they're not just five of the same type. Do you have one that does embroidery? 
Cynthia, welcome in. Thank you for coming. How are you? What's in your cup and what is off your hook? Roberta got a few this week. It was a productive week, finished on Saturday. She has finished a, oh, this is her little, little, little oh, I forgot the name of this thing that matches the blanket. Oh, you all know I don't know the baby's names. Roberta, what is this thing? You told me, but you know I don't remember. But look at you, you did a good job. Okay, I just lost myself. <laughs> so we're just going to move right along while I find myself. Ah, Roberta, scoot over. I'm, on, I'm joining you on the corner of Lost and Confused. Speaking of Roberta, she finished this on Saturday. Oh, this is so cute. I love this. Oh. Are so cute. Oh, Roberta. Okay, now let's see. Which way do I go, George? Which way do I go? There we go. Okay. Nancy says it is pretty in person, but I didn't have a model and good lighting. Girl, that is okay. That sounds like me. I kept having to go outside. See, I, I I can't since I had children. No smoking at hospitals here. The security will raise all kinds of ruckus. Ooh. Nancy, I was lucky the ER was right next to a park. Oh my Lord. Miguel says, VJ, the way you impersonate Shorty cracks me up. <laughs> She is. She's got this little squeaky voice and this big attitude. Hospitals here has a borny five that zips around in a golf cart chasing smokers. <laughs> Sandra. <laughs> Nancy says, I just sit in the car. I'm usually scarier than security. <laughs> you all are something else. Samantha, welcome in. How are you? Yeah, Bridget needs her own shit. I would, I'm, I need to get down to where she answers whether or not she has a um, basement. And Zoila is thanking Jerry for the package. What is in my cup and what is on my hook? Well, Nifty, thank you for asking. I'm still drinking coffee. <laughs> I've, I've been, I, my hands have been busy today. Okay. My daughter is in a rough, on a ruffle hat kick. And then her girlfriend decided that she wanted the ruffle hat in the roster colors. So I finished that. And while I was working on it, my cousin saw it. So she's like, I want one. So I'm in the process of making one for my cousin. And then my daughter says, well, I'm getting a blue outfit for Easter. Can, can you make me a blue one as well? So my daughter, and she says, I need it a little bigger because I have a bigger head. So my daughter has a blue one for Easter. And she says, do you have any yarn left? Can I have a ruffle scarf? So... She also has a ruffled scarf. And then she says, have you finished my brown one? I'm like, look, kid. <laughs> and then she says, Shardy needs a white one for the summer in cotton. So the Pima cotton came in last night. 
thank you all who answered my question about summer cottons. Pima cotton, cotton came in last night. So I'm going to be starting a hat for Shorty with ruffles. <sighs> so it's kind of, one. once I get the hat done, if I keep my lights up, I realized that I had skipped a couple of stitches because I don't know, I was doing lives, I was reading books. I don't know what I was doing, but it's like, I gotta pay attention to my stitches or I got turned around and went the other way. I don't know what happened, but it all worked out in the end. It was just kind of crazy in the middle. Nisi, welcome in. Thank you for coming in. How are you? What's in your cup? What's off your hook? Heading, I think our healthcare system is heading towards private, but oh, it sucks so badly for you all over there, girl. Our healthcare, it, it needs an overhaul. It really, really seriously needs an overhaul. Mimi's laughing at me. Bridget, when King gets well, he needs to make you a huge palace. Ooh. Bridget says, houses down here don't come with basements very often. But yeah, I finally could use a huge space of my own. Yeah. Yeah. So your house doesn't have a basement. That would really be... And you just set it up with all of your things all in one room and you wouldn't have and just have it sectioned off. Crystal says, I have never been yelled at by security, but nurses, yes, I seem to scare men. I live in this mode. <laughs> Darcy is playing with the emojis. Thank you. Sabrina, welcome in. Good to see you. Thank you for being here. How are you? Thank you, Lauren. Yeah, I've been I've been a ruffle making fool over here. I guess they were. <laughs> oh, dry. oh, Sheila, thank you, thank you. Yep, she's like, wow. No, I sold my L wheel. I wasn't a fan of the machine. Okay, okay, okay. You need a quilt loom too, girl. See, I want. We're going to the Midwest Fiber Fest, and I won't even take the um, heddle loom class because I love weaving, and that's the last. I, last thing I need is another project. I mean, seriously, I I I I don't need another project because I love I love weaving. Our Kathleen has finished her C to C, two shades of pink, slant shell. Oh, it's not a C to C. She's got two shades of pink, slant shell baby comforter. Okay. Two shades of pink in the slant shell. That's cute, Kathleen. Pam, no, Pam taught the staggered shell. I was going to say, Pam just taught us that the other day. No, she taught the staggered shell. I didn't know you could do so many things with shells. Because when I was doing shells, I just did them the plain, plain old everyday vanilla shells. Mimi says, Bridget, I know you are very gifted. I'm slapping my own hand for the off-color joke. <laughs> Ah, okay. And EOD, Explosive Ordnance Disposal Tech. Oh, thank you. I, I knew you had told me, but you know, I don't remember. No, it's, it's a slant shell. Or, okay, Zoella, you're talking about Roberta. Roberta, was that um, baby blanket a C to C? And she says, yes. Okay. Uh, I haven't had, I, I, yeah, I haven't finished Mikhail. <laughs> uh, I, I, 
am I, am I lagging? I use my dining room for my office, sewing and crochet, family dinner. So you have an all purpose room. It is cute. The doctors here no longer allow it within 200 feet of any doors. I don't remember what our footage was. The whole campus is technically smoke free, but you get somebody to make them stop. Taking you with me to give flock fresh water. Okay, I'll go. I knew it was a unicorn, did not know why I wrote pony. Uh, Jen, welcome in, welcome in. I'm sitting in my tree house working on my elephant and fixing dinner. Who said I can't multitask? Exactly. What's for dinner, Jen? Roberta says, cuz without the horn, it could be a pony, right? Thank you, Darcia. Zala, you still doing much better with than my mind and finger today. Girl, thank you. Dawn says, Roberta, you can call me Al. <laughs> Mara, welcome in. Good to see you. Thank you for being here. Thank you, Zoila and Mimi and everybody. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. <laughs> she wants a lot. Teach her to crochet. See, when she was younger and I tried to teach her to crochet, she didn't have the patience. Now that she's older and she actually wants to wear crochet, she's got cataracts and she can't see the stitches. I tried to teach her and it's really hard for her to see around her floaties. I don't know. I said, you, and I told her, I said, you need to learn how to do this because I'm not going to always be here. I hope they appreciate it. I hope they do, Mimi. It it actually does my heart good that she's now asking for it. Because I, I made them crochet stuff the whole time they were little. And it was kind of like, oh, mom, mom's got me a hat. Okay. I got a muffler. Okay. I got mittens. I'm warm. But now she's actually asking for it. So that it, it does my heart good. Oh, I love it with the hats and the scarf. I love how the hat and scarf match. I would wear that with pride. Thank you, Nifty. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, she's uh so she's she's coming around. Pima cotton is the best. Okay. Yeah, because I, I was I had asked everybody about it last week and everybody kind of agreed Pima cotton. So I ordered it and it finally came in last night. Oh, people, I need to share a book recommendation. Glucose Revolution by Jesse. Uh huh. Incomp. Inch. Incasse. She's also a YouTube as Glucose Revolution. So what is she going to do? Get me off glucose or get my glucose regulated? What 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 is her take on glucose? Yeah, our healthcare is is just is sad. It really is. My eyes are too bad to give recommendations, girl. Yeah, she's got she she's one of those that puts the glasses on, takes the glasses off, puts the glasses on, and then she's doing all of this and she's. I was like, you need to go have them removed. Okay, Mimi, thank you for being here. Ah, oh, Lauren, what are you getting me into? I want a weaving loom so bad. I have a small one picked out if I ever get enough saved up for it. Bridget, we're related. <laughs> I, I want to, I, I, yeah, I, I want to weave a Ruana. I really do. And it's kind of like, I, I, I cannot take on another craft, but I really want to weave a Ruana. 
our healthcare system. Girl, say it over again. I'm, I'm, it starts from the top down. And if the top is rotten, the bottom is not going to get any better. And since we can't do anything about the top, I, I, I don't see it's, it, it happening anytime soon unless it involves one of their family members. Then they will stand up and take notice, but not unless they are affected. Sarah has done a boho style cocoon cardigan. Sarah, girl, girl Sarah, you make me tired. Talking about somebody who, who, who does all the things. Sarah, girl, stand up and take a bow. That is so flipping cute. Oh, we. Girl. I love it. I want to purchase a sewing machine, but as a beginner, I don't know what to get with so many options. Um, if you think you are going to be get, doing a lot of sewing, get a Singer sewing machine. It, it's a workhorse and they are relatively inexpensive. But if you think that it's something that you're just going to be using every now and then, get you one of those little sewing machines from Aldi. They're all right. Somebody and somebody even did a review. I don't remember who did it, but somebody did a review of the Aldi sewing machines. But if you think you're going to be doing some, you know, serious sewing, get a singer. Bridget, my mom had a weaving loom that took up the shed. I loved that loom. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, girl. See, Bridget, I'm not sure if it's the same thing, but these creative hands talked might be a video of a loom she made with two by fours. She showed the rug she made with it. Oh, yeah. And you know what? Isela has made her own looms as well. It's a knit magic. Wow. That would... Okay, Roberta, wow. That would be awesome to see. Yeah, it would. Bonnie, hello, hello. Girl, yes. I was outside. And when I finished this live, I'm taking the laptop and going back outside. I came inside to do the live because it's, it's there's too much road noise outside. Mishi, sweetheart, welcome in. So good to see you. Thank you for coming in. Are you feeling better? Or are your meds starting to work? Sabrina is saying to Zoila, I think the Singer 4452 from Hobby Lobby is a good starter sewing machine. See, I said Singer. Here comes Sabrina with, with the model numbers. Go ahead, Sabrina. Thank you. Yes, the singers are good machines. They really are. And wait until they they have the 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 have them on sale. They might have them on sale for Mother's Day. Crystal says they really do Zyla. Almost all medical studies are. Mm hmm. Yep. 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 Yes, indeed. I have a small loom like D made. I just want something that can do a bit more than that. Yeah, because you know you you can weave it, but then you've got to sew the panels together. I don't. Well, we know how I feel about sewing panels together. But you know what, Bridget? You can no. Yeah, the loom's got to be the size of whatever you're making. Yeah. I, I, I had to stop and think a minute. Jen is having frozen chicken parmesan, mac and cheese, and mashed potatoes. Maybe corn if I feel like it. Jen, you're having ch chicken parmesan, but you're not having spaghetti. Then you're having 
macaroni and cheese and mashed potatoes and corn. That's all the same color. You're not eating the rainbow. Throw you some green stuff in there. How about a salad or some string beans? You gotta, you gotta, you gotta have another color. Listen to me. <laughs> yeah, it's very sad. It's very sad. I did, I did a boat in a lake house yesterday. And after my house today, I got McDonald's and came home and went into and went to bed after I, I unleashed the girls. 500. Girl, I hear you. Got to unleash the girls. Yep. 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 I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. BJ, it's a, it's a two shades of pink reversible slanted shell baby blanket. Okay, go ahead with your bad self. Go ahead with your bad self. Two shades of pink. All right, now. And Sarah has also finished her shawl. If I remember correctly, this shawl is for her mother-in-law. But don't quote me on that because we know what my memory is like. Sarah, if it's not for your mother-in-law, please correct me. But I absolutely love it. That is pretty. That is pretty. Jen says, Debbie frozen is the key, easy and no cleanup. You didn't say 500. Is Siri speaking for you again? Hugs, Mishi. Thank you for coming by. I appreciate it. Lauren says, glucose regulation and eating in a way that flattens down glucose spikes. Oh, okay. Thank you. I will have to check that one out. Kelly, welcome in. Thank you for coming by. How are you? Kelly, we, we're doing a test today. I have uh, redirected to your live. Thank you for scheduling it. So when you go live, if I've done this correctly, we're automatically coming over to watch you make a souffle. Did you hear Lou Gossett? No, what happened Lou Gossett? What did he say? Kelly, I kept a waffle maker out. I scrambled some eggs, you know, stirred it poured in there, put cheese on, close the lid. It was good. So you scrambled your eggs in the waffle maker. Okay. I screenshot the directions from Sarah. I think I can do it. Okay, Roberta, from your lips, we're here for you. We are. I just got a singer from under $90 from Amazon. Elissa, welcome in. So good to see you. I'm sorry. Did you, Have you spoken earlier? I did not see you. How are you? What's in your cup and what is off your hook? Bonnie says, I want a brother for 40 years and something happened to that one and I bought another brother and it's going strong. I love brother for a sewing machine. I like the singer. I really do. You got it, Roberta. It's easy. And thanks everyone. You are so welcome. Thank you. Zoila, start out with a thrift store sewing machine, then go bigger. Well, Cricket, that's an idea too. Zoila, see if they have a an estate sale in your area. Go to um, estatesales.net and see if they're having an estate sale in your area. And you can get a, a good sewing machine for cheaper because, you know, people don't have room for everything anymore. Crystal is a huge uh, proponent of the Brother Sewing Machines. 
Sue says, I'm a beginner sewer. I went to the U.S. and purchased a Singer sewing machine from Joann's. Mm -hmm. Bonnie says, and the brother I got is $89 at Walmart, unless you're going to do a bunch of fancy stuff. I sew paper and a little mending and stuff packed. You can't even make a shirt on it. It just doesn't have, doesn't have fancy st stitches and you'll never use them unless you're a seamstress. Well, my grandmother was a seamstress and she had um, uh, all singers. No, I didn't know Lou Gossett Jr. passed. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, Mara, thank you so very much. Okay, everybody, it's time to get up out of your chairs. We're gonna dance for Mara. I can't get my thing to work. What the French toast? StreamYard is not working for me today. Pam was correct. Thank you so much, Mara. I appreciate it. Singer used to be the best, but I think brother is the best. Just my opinion. Okay. Kim, welcome in. Welcome in. I appreciate you being in the bushes. So happy to have you here. No, it didn't, Sheila. I love some of his movies. No, I did not know that. That's so sad. We're losing so many. Okay, gave Flock fresh water and got busy doing some yarn chore, yard chores. You be careful out there. I live in a house that these that live here eat too picky. I could make four different meals. No way. Oh, Lord. Yeah, no, we're not doing all that. You got picky eaters, girl. Yeah. And Sarah has a corded shell infinity scarf. Oh, yeah, I like shells and cords. Uh, let's see, I got to go back to Lauren, but I need a smaller comment. That's pretty, Sarah. That is so cute. Thank you so very much, Mara. Let's see, go back to Lauren. Okay. I had salad vegetables followed by a bit of leftover chicken that didn't fit in my wrap. Then I had a chicken wrap with lettuce and grated carrot, peri peri chicken, perinaise, and chili jam. They put the grated carrot on your chicken wrap. That's interesting. I haven't had it like that before. I'm going to have to try that. Jen, I always told my kids that this is not a drive through Do you want to eat? You eat what I make, right? Yep, Sue, she, she, she's doing it over there. She Sarah does such beautiful work. She really does. It was a fake Nando's effectively. <laughs> Nando's? Jen, we have three adults. No one eats at the same time or the same food. Every once in a while, we eat together and holidays. See, Siri makes me look like something else, but I hate typing. <laughs> you are welcome, Kelly. I am so sorry. I did not get that today. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Okay, Alyssa, because I was like, I did not see you, honey. But thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Bonnie says, Kelly, when I was on keto, I learned how to do that. It's good. And I was hungry. I needed something fast. And now... 
now. Alyssa has nothing in her cup and she is working on her, on a shawl. Who's pattern, Alyssa? Oh yeah, it's pretty out here. It really is. Yeah, what, what the French toast. Yeah, I, because you know, being around patients, there was a whole lot of things I couldn't say. And I did not say those types of words around the kids. So yeah, I was kind of like, what the French toast. My grandmother used to say, what the plu pluck of the hell? And I'm like, what's the plu pluck of the, hmm. Suze has, uh, is showing a spike. Last week, she showed us, I guess it was Spike's girlfriend. But today we have Spike. Look at his little mohawk. Oh, that is too cute. That's too cute. I'm so cute. Okay, I danced for Mara. I didn't know my hips could do that. <laughs> Sabrina says, I recommended the singer 4452 to my participants and all of them are still going strong. It is a heavy duty machine. Thank you, Sabrina. And Sabrina works in a uh, senior citizens place. So apparently that sewing machine is easy to understand and operate since they're still going strong. Crystal says Singer is no longer the company it once was. Also, I have an issue with the company that started making their machines less reliable on purpose out of fear their sales would drop. Now, that is a problem. Jerry says, reminding me of the television version of Snakes on a Plane. I'm tired of the Monday to Friday snake on the monkey <laughs> plane. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it sounded like my doctor asked me, what, what is wrong? And I said, I am sick and tired of being sick and tired. And she's like, well, when was the last time you felt good? I said, December of 2019. Fix me. I'm tired of this. And she's like, okay, let's see what we can do. Everybody clap. Paula's got electricity. Yay. That is awesome. I am happy for you. And I apologize to anybody who has earbuds in. But that's exciting. Michelle, hello, hello. In the bushes getting this whipped back to where I frogged it last due to misstitch and had to take out <gasps> 10 rows. They were granny rolls. No worries, though. Okay. And and when you mess up, why is it on the easiest row? It's kind of like, I know how to do this. I can do this in my sleep. How did I mess this up? Right, Michelle? Oh, and this is your congratulations on your first week back to work. How you feel? Pat yourself on the back, girlfriend. Uh, Bonnie says, yes, DC, a lady I know is a professional seller. And she told me the singer is not the same company. That is unfortunate. That really is. <laughs> Just as a, I might've broke the tree branch under the tree house I'm in. <laughs> ah, oh. Kim says, we had pork rolls, corn, brown rice, and salads. Yummy. Oh, I don't know what those last three items are. Which last three items, Shirley? That I showed on the screen? The last one was a somebody. The one before that was... Let me scroll down and see if Shirley. You've never heard of Nando's. Okay. 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 She's talking to Lauren. Okay. Pam says spaghetti and side salad with homemade garlic toast here for dinner tonight. Ooh. Bonnie says, Jen, what? Get out of the treehouse. 
Nana Michelle had spaghetti thanks to Sunita. Sunita did her spaghetti in the Instapod. Have you ever heard of that, uh, Nana Michelle? Siri, that was professional sewer. Sewer. Okay. Is Nando's not a thing over there? It's delicious, but overpriced chicken. Is it? Yeah, I, I, Nando's is not a thing over here. Is Nando's the restaurant or is Nando's the style? See, now y'all got me trying to find out what the night. Nando's Patty Patty. Nando's is a South African multinational fast casual chain that specializes in Portuguese flame grilled peri peri style chicken. Mm -mm, we ain't got none of that over here. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Let's see, are there Nando's in America? As of 2023, there are 45 restaurant outlets in the United States, only present within the DC, Baltimore, Chicago, Houston, and Dallas metropolitan areas. 12 are in Illinois, six in Washington, DC, 13 in Maryland, 10 in Virginia, two in Houston, and one in Dallas. So the rest of us are SOL. That's just sad. I'm a lot of fun, Jen. I just don't want to hang out in the treehouse. I'm afraid of heights anyway. I'm not afraid of heights. I'm afraid of falling. <laughs> That's okay, Kim. We just appreciate you being here. Oh, you added an F-O. Okay, girlfriend. Thank you for letting me know because, you know, I'm, I, I had to go find out what Anandos was because I did not know what Lauren was talking about. Which is 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 not, you know, anything strange. It, it's normal for me. Oh, here is Spike's rump. Spike's got a cute rump. With his mohawk. We have Taco Bell, but we spell bell with an H here. <laughs> Lauren, if you don't have Taco Bell, you weren't missing much. It's good, but you pay for it later. <laughs> ah. Oh, my gosh. Okay. See, I learned something new. I haven't tried it. My husband has. I'm not really a fast food kind of person, really, except for occasional McDonald's nuggets. Girl, don't, 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 don't eat them. Do not. Do not. Do not. Michelle says, thank you. Glad to have a kind of normalcy around here. A strange training week, but all is good. Been home no later than 4 p.m. with the new job. It's so nice. And you have to go in every day? You're not going to be doing remote? I wanted a pork roast, but the prices have gotten crazy. A small one was over $20. Ooh. I made spaghetti in the Instapot. Did you really? See, y'all doing all kinds of stuff. Oren says, I know it isn't chicken, but their caramel cheesecake is also delicious. <laughs> you all, they are not in the Chicago area. Bonnie, I just read you what Mr. Google said. I've, I am not in control of anything for anybody from any reason. Or maybe it's new since you moved. Sue says, this is Carla. Oh, my gracious. Everybody say hi to Carla. Sue, she is too cute. She is too cute. Welcome back, Tank. Nana Michelle says, hey, in the virtual tree house, there are no heights or I wouldn't be in there either. Oh, well, now I feel better. Bonnie says, Michelle, I can go to the virtual tree house. No problem. Okay. And there are my members. Oh, 
Bonnie says, cute. And she says, if you're expecting Mexican food, Taco Bell, don't have it. But Taco Bell, when it's quick, right? Aren't they cute, Pam? Nana Michelle says, yes, I have to go in the offices. I process payments for a bank. Okay, how is parking? Do you have to pay an arm and both legs for parking? I remember that was an issue with the other job. Oh, Bridget has made a shrug to go with her dress. Oh, look at you, Bridget. Oh, how cute is that? Wow. Wow. I am okay with heights falling even, but the splat, that's the problem. <laughs> Crystal! <laughs> I was like, I, I, I am okay with flying in a plane. My stomach doesn't like it, but it's the fear of falling that really bothers me. Oh, Bridget, this is too, too cute. You did such a good job. Look at you. Oh, man. Wow. Go ahead with your bad self. Go ahead with your bad self. Bridget, stand up and take a bow. BJ, you got through the chat. That might be the first time in a hundred years. It's early yet, Bonnie. Don't, don't, don't jinx me. Don't jinx me. It's early yet. <laughs> What did Bonnie do? Which time, Jen? Which time? The parking is close and free. <gasps> the parking at the other place was free also, but was far. The paying for parking is Kelly. Okay. She parks far and has to pay. Okay. I thought that was also your issue, but yours was free, but just far away. Bridget, your dress and shawl is gorgeous. Isn't it Chris, Cricket? Bowing down to Bridget and her beautiful dress and all. Yeah, she is the queen. Be right back. My son is over. If not, I'll see y'all later in the YT streets. Okay, Darcia. You know we're going to do a VJ raid over at I Bring It Every Day. You're welcome, Sue's girl. Because you all are out here doing such inspirational work. Shirley, uh, I says, I have two little FOs, a skull keychain for my daughter, and a short road Tunisian washcloth found on Ravelry from YouTube. Found on Ravelry from YouTuber. Hey, Fiber Friends. Okay. Go ahead, Shirley. Look at you. Wow. My goodness. That's scary. That's cute. Look at you. Okay, Shirley. Wow. Shirley's out here getting stuff off of Ravelry. Which is a great place. I was so surprised when I found out that Ravelry had free patterns. And then here is her short road Tunisian washcloth. Oh, Shirley, this is cute. This is so cute. Wow, look at the texture. That is nice. I worked too much to get an FO, but almost finished baby boots. Okay. Did you ever finish that project you were using the Stenley yarn with? 
I remember you had to order the Stanley and it came in and then you went back to work and I lost track of what was happening. Shirley, that's pretty. Why are you driving? Oh, never mind. I know where you came from. I was trying to figure out why this boat was going past my house. Like, there's a boat outside my house. Why? I don't live by any body of water big enough for this boat. I'm open, finished baby boots, hard hat, and almost blanket. <laughs> It's okay. It's Friday. You've had a long week. You're off tomorrow, tomorrow, right? Chris says, here's a bracelet that took my attention. Chain mail. Ooh, Heart of Orion jewelry. Heart of Orion jewelry. Titanium links because of allergies. Cliff has many beautiful colors available. Faceted beads on elastic thread from my stash. Oh, Chris, girl, stop. Ooh. Wait a minute. Where's my... There we go. Good night. Thank you for coming in, Lauren. Wow, Chris, that's pretty. Ooh, 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 ooh. That is pretty. Bonnie's saying to DC, I'm about to get really busy because two clients are back at their lake houses and boat, boat. I don't know if I'm ready to be so busy. I hear you. Jen says, boat. Noah built a boat. You better get in. Wait, grab your yarn first. Right. Mama went home. Well, you got in just in time. I'm ooing and out, owing over your bracelet. Girl, this is pretty. Oh, this is just gorgeous. You got here right in the nick of time. Oh, I love this. And I, I, I have no clue where to even start on something like this. Crystal says, I was off today, but still had 38 hours last week. I got 58. Oh, Lord. That's pretty. I used to do chain mail jewelry. Did you, Suze? Did you really? I love it. I absolutely love it. Pat yourself on the back, Chris. That is pretty. Honest to Pete. Dinky Jen has a quick bod beanie for a change. In this looks cranberry and black to me, but what do I know? Cranberry and burgundy? That's pretty, Jen. Five more pictures in the lineup. Okay. I would live in that boat is bigger than my last apartment and probably nicer. <laughs> Sue says, yep, I sure did earrings and bracelets. Ooh, why did you stop, Sue's? She missed a few. She missed a few of mine, but it's okay. How did I miss some of yours? Hold up. How did I miss yours? Were you out of the room? Let me refresh and see what's going on here. I got you you did the little animals, you did the unicorn. I've only got two of yours in here. And there's Shirley, there's Chris and Jen. Jen also has a strawberry income impkin 
not all the white shows up. Okay. It does look like a strawberry. You, you only had two in there, Roberta. Check what you sent. Or is it in the group and not in the um, comment? Because I'm, I'm going through the comment first. If it's in the group, I'll pick it up if we have time. But there's only two in the comment. It's not my fault this time. Except for I have to do gymnastics to make the beds. I like it. I hear you. The materials were getting too expensive. Oh, I see. There's no cow in there. Missed my blanket, but it's okay. You sent a blanket in the email, Pam? Oh, Jen, I put a picture of the boat and the dock on my community tab. Okay. Yeah, there's only two. Okay. Yeah, there's only two in, in the... Um... They were in with the unicorn. There's only one picture with the unicorn. Hold on. This is Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I see you, you, I, okay. You, you put it. Okay. I see what you did. I see what you did. I don't know how you did it, but I see what you did. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I did not know you commented on yourself. You got to tell me these things. I didn't, I didn't know you had done this. Look at those eyes. It's in the email. Jen, it uh Pam, uh what you sent. Okay. You sent the one picture. And the second thing you attached was not the blanket. It was a video of my live. So check what you sent. You didn't send the blanket. Because I was sitting here trying to figure out, why would you send me my own video? <laughs> like, what is she trying to do to me? What is she trying to tell me? <laughs> Isn't he cute? I was like, wait a minute, Pam. What, 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 what? Yeah, no, you sent me a video. And so are you talking about the blanket that the unicorn is on, Roberta? Is that what you're telling me? You also did that? Him's cute, him's cute. And I'm sorry, Roberta, I did not see that you, I thought they had commented on your picture. I didn't realize you had put more pictures in the comments. I didn't realize you could do that. So thank you. I just learned something. You all are always teaching me things. Yes, Pam, please. I got time. Girl, I didn't know. See, I, we've already had we've already had the talk about me having to 
open up the message to read what's being said because I just look at the pictures. You all have to tell me if I have to read stuff. I don't know. I'm learning. I'm learning. This is this this is a this is a learning tool for me, and I bless all of you for your patience and per, per, perseverance because you all are teaching me. Don't give up on me. Mama's learning things. You can teach an old dog new tricks. I'm just telling you. Tanky Poo has put in Impkin number two. These are cute. Tank, these are so flipping cute. Look what Tank did. Oh. Oh, you're too cute. I love those little mushroom hats. I really do. I love those little mushroom hats. We got horses, we got cows, we got all kinds of stuff going on in here today. Oh, Lord, Bridget, you didn't hurt yourself when you fell, did you? Uh, put on your seatbelts, honey. We can't have you falling out the window. I went by Mona's for a month for you, and I still love you. Yes, you did. Yes, you did, and I appreciate you. I really, really do. You did. You did. But I call you Kim now. Usually. <laughs> Oh, girl, I you just have to tell me. You just have to tell me. Because I don't know these things, but I'm learning. And I love that you all have patience with me. DYD has a sum bunny for Zach's Crafts made with Lion Brand Amazing Yarn. Oh, oh, Zach's going to love that. He is absolutely going to love that. Okay, go back to Dawn. Oh, he, Zach's going to love that. Oh, DYD, that is cute. Look, look what Missy has done. She's got a whole little... little uh, cottage industry of some bunnies going on here. Bonnie says, I'd be right back. Somebody's knocking on my door. I don't want to get out of bed, but I'm gonna. Yeah. That's like, I'm always asking, why, why are you knocking on my door? I did not invite you over here. Did you call and ask me if I wanted company? Go away. I'm busy. I'm working over here. Kim finished an impkin. Kim, girl, you and your staging. I tell you, you, you and Sarah have got it going on. That is so cute. You all. I am loving these impkins. I really am loving these impkins. These are so cute. I'm still here listening and lurking. Thank you, Cindy. I appreciate it. Bonnie says, okay, I think I'm just hearing stuff. Honey, you got to check. <laughs> Tank says, I don't answer my door if you don't have an appointment. Girl, I hear you. I hear you. Zoella says, BJ says, I'm working over here. Girl, I'm working over here, really. That's why my daughter has not gotten her fingerless gloves done because every time I get started on them, she calls, okay? It goes back in the project bag and I pull out the crochet. When I get to them, you'll get them done. She'll have them by next winter and then she'll want something else. OMG, yeah, cuteness overload. I'm telling you, they're beautiful. And I love Kim's staging between Kim and Sarah. I'm, it's like, I'm not even in the same building as them. I'm, I, I'm not even. I am not even. Okay, let me see. Let me see if Pam sent 
her blanket because she sent me something. Here we go. Pam. Oh, Pam, that's cute. Hold on. Now we got the blanket. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out why this girl is sending me my own video. Why are you making videos of me, Pam? <laughs> I said, why are you recording me? Girl, here we go. Pam, this is too cute. Oh, I love it. I have not done that ripple stitch. That's pretty. That is so pretty. And DYD is the uh, Chevron queen. Thank you, Pam. And Zoila is laughing at me. Zoila, you know how I get. They are so, so adorable. The little impkins and bunnies love them all, right? And these, these are like little rabbits. They just keep multiplying. They are just gorgeous. And each one is prettier than the one before. Pam says, I'm not stalking you. I promise. That's okay. I wanted to see it. And thank you for bringing it to my attention. Because when I saw that last week, I meant to ask you about it. And I forgot to. Remember, I, I told you on Monday, you send me stuff on Monday for Friday, you're going to have to remind me because I'm not going to remember. And I had seen the little MP4 and I'm like, why is she sending me video? And so I had to open it up and see what was in there. And I'm like, she's sending me myself. Why is she doing that? <laughs> oh, my. So thank you for bringing it to my attention because I did not have the blanket. Right, Cricket? They are so cute. They really are cute. Now, did anybody send an email that I missed for FO Friday or a FO in the group that I missed? Because we have five minutes, so I have time to pick up a couple more that I've missed. I know you love your chevrons. Your baby blankers are gorgeous. But they are coming up with some Chevron things that is like, ooh. Okay. Thank you all. Kelly just went live. So fasten your seat belts. Uh, we're going to do a uh, VJ raid over to I Bring It Every Day. And you don't have to do anything because I've got the redirect on, hopefully. I want to thank everybody who has spent this last hour with me. And I don't know why I'm hearing things. You could have spent it anywhere, but you chose to spend it with me. And I do not take it lightly. Please socially distance. Do what you need to do to protect yourselves. Because, uh, you know, we got all kinds of stuff going on around in the world. And as we've heard the, the stories, our health care is not always what it needs to be, and Kelly is making souffles. You are welcome, Dawn. Everybody, please have a happy, healthy weekend. Um, keep your hands inside the ride at all times. Thank you, Jen. Jen, I showed your hat. It is so cute. I have to finish up the later, Jen. Jen, leave it on because we're, we're trying something new. Everybody, love you. Let's see if we can make this work. Take care now. Happy Easter each and every one of you. Bye-bye.